Good morning, everyone. This is Wednesday, August the 31st. I'm Brandi Cummings. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. We have an update on the investigation into anti-Semitic banners over an overpass in Davis. The Yolo County District Attorney has released a statement. The DA called on Governor Gavin Newsom to sign a current bill into law. He says AB 557 will require the Department of Justice to establish a grant program to expand prosecution units for hate crimes. A bill that impacts public restrooms is headed to Governor Gavin Newsom to either sign or veto. Senate Bill 1194 would allow for multi-stall gender-neutral bathrooms in cities that choose to pass such an ordinance. The city of West Hollywood applauded the passage of that bill. We are now less than 10 weeks until the midterm election. President Biden and Democrats are ramping up their rhetoric as they try to keep control of Congress. President Biden is pushing his Safer America plan. He's calling on Congress for billions in police and public safety funding and wanting tougher gun laws. For a check of the forecast, let's head over now to meteorologist Melanie Hunter. Good morning. We are waking up to a pretty nice morning. 60s for us in the valley, cooler in the 50s from the delta to the coast. Even a bigger drop in temperatures in Truckee and South Lake Tahoe in the upper 40s and waking up to a mild start in the 70s in the foothills. So here's what you need to know today all about the temperature trend. 9 a.m. We're in the 60s by noon. We're warming up to the mid to upper 80s. Plenty of sunshine, light wind should get our temperature in the upper 90s near 100 degrees for the valley. It'll stay mild this evening. We're still talking about some very hot temperatures for your holiday weekend. And that's a look at what we're following here on KCRE 3 today.